Hyman Black, backstage on day three of Riot Fest, and I'm here with Lucky X. How are you doing, man? I'm doing good, bro. I just got my best performance. Um, I feel real good with my homies right now. We fucking getting high, smoking squares, yeah. illegal teenager shit. I'm just playing. <laughs> I'm just, yeah. yeah, man, you got you just came off stage like five minutes ago. You're, you're playing to like a really good crowd. It's like late afternoon. How did you feel about it? Gee, um, I'm gonna be honest. This is my first. This is my. This, this me. This is my first because this is my first festival performing at a festival. So it's a big festival too. You feel me? So I was scared at first because I wasn't really promoting it, and it's like people was. This shit was just cracking. Like that shit was just. I was just like, like I don't know. That shit was just some shit. And then we, us three in Miami on um, Thursday for another show. So we, we just, we just every show getting better. How did you get on the Riot Fist bill? Because I know like there was a lot of local talent that got added pretty late. So I think you were one of the later additions. How did that come to be? I've been, I've been, I've been on, I've been on it. Oh, you've been on it, okay? Because I know some local artists got added like right before. But how did it come? You know, how did you get on the bill? How did this happen? My big brother Andrew Barber from Facial Drive. So yeah. he put me on my big brother. Um, what you call it? He put me on that shit. Yeah, Andrew, he's good people, man. Absolutely. So, uh, so you know. The new mixtape just dropped. It's called Body High. How are you feeling about that? I feel like Body High is... How you feel like... What you feel about Body High, people? I feel like Body High... 10 out of 10, I feel like we feel We got the Molly right now, too. So it's Smolly game right now. So we give you, we put being real honest. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All the honesty. How long was this mixtape in the work? Since, since Alternative Trap dropped on show. Exactly. Since Alternative Trap And you were 16 when that dropped, and you're 18 now, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah. So about a two-year process for this? Real talk, because like, it was hella souls that I was going to put on there that I ended up putting on there, you know? Because I had went through. Because I'm going to be honest, because, you know, you know, everybody know. I want everybody to know me, you know? I'm addicted to Xanax. Yeah. We all are. All of us is. I think that comes through on the mixtape pretty well. Oh, okay. we do, we, 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 I just want everybody to know about the Xanax. So, like, I, so, of course, like, like throughout the, like, times of, yeah, 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 yeah. Throughout the times of us making um, Body High, like, we had, like, troubles, like, because, you know, like, I tried to stop making it. I tried to stop doing it. And then, like, I, a lot of shit came. It was, like, a lot of confidence. And then, you know, it's, me and him, it's just me. This like, is my best friend. Basically, hella shit happened, right? And basically, like, we like, was going off, off, off that shit. shit. We was going off that shit. And basically, like, the beach shit we was doing, everything just came together. Like, at first, we was tweaking. We thought we was tweaking. But then after the project, like, all the, all the complex ass beats we making, we, it just all came together. And it became a 10 out of 10 project. Ain't nobody doing what we doing in Chicago. You feel me? Yeah. And hey, what's your name? My name is Pluto Nash. Producer, man. Yeah, absolutely, man. Absolutely. Man, if you hit Nash effect, man, Nash effect, that's me. <laughs> you know, so I know that the mixtape, it's, it's received a lot of attention. A lot of people are talking about it. Were you surprised by that? Were you surprised by how many people kind of jumped on with it? Or were you anticipating that? I'm not going to lie. I knew it. I knew it. I like that, man. No false modesty. You knew this was going to happen. Yeah, I knew it. Yeah, I knew. I knew. I knew soon. Because, like, I knew soon as I got on my shit. Like, because, you know, like, when I turn the trap and shit, like, that shit people listen to that shit, they think that shit, they be like, that shit raw, you feel me? Bro, I wasn't even on my shit, I'm on my shit now, like, when I tell motherfuckers, like, like, I'm on my shit, like, every, like, every rapper, like, I'm on my shit, like, like, I'm coming, like, like, we are really coming, like, we working hard to sell, like, like, shout out to my big brother Chief Keith from Glow Gang, you know, you already know, he, he, you know, he just, he just gave me that shout out, he just gave me some old fans, I got a song with Chance finna drop soon, just... I sound like a cliche rapper right now, but just know we coming. For they don't real. Even know no, no, man. Shit. I, they don't even know who produces shit. Him, him, Lucky X featuring Chance the Rapper Zoning, produced by Young Chop and Pluto Nash. Yeah, let's talk about the Chance collaboration. I was going to ask about that and some of the other collaborations. How did the Chance thing come? You know, do you guys know each other, go way back, or kind of how did that happen? Man, Chance go way back. So I was like 13 from you meet it. You know, that's my nigga. That's been my nigga. I just, we just it, well, had, to wait for, had to wait for the right time to um, make the song, you know? He. We um we was, I was like, cause you know um save money and one nine seven you know like you know like we all like kind of like one thing you know we game basically, so like we so we all together he just Facetime I'm like studio session tonight and then I had Facetime chop and I'm like yeah studio session tonight then we already asked and then I, he, I was with him already we was on the block and then we just it just came together yeah yeah, yeah. you know do we have any idea when and where the people are gonna <laughs> any idea when and where people are gonna hear that is it gonna drop on one of your projects one of his or is there any kind of uh, um it's no, coming you, know. you never know but just know. More visuals from Body Hot, cause um Complex, my um videographer Jimmy Jimmy Regular um Comp Me is him and Complex. They um uh, my video my bo- both my videographers. I'm sorry, Point and Shoot, Jay Gaza and Jimmy Regular, um, um collaborating with Complex shoot the video um but it's on finesse that I did with my homie um my Bruiser Brigade homie um Skywalker. 
So, um, yeah, I'm off the Molly. I'm geeking right now. That's why I'm talking like this. Um, people gonna hear this? I want people to hear this. People are gonna hear this. People are gonna hear the audio. So, this is like, like people gonna hear the audio? I, I yeah, love this absolutely. shit. Hey, I love y'all. What about FKA Twigs? It's another artist who, you know, blowing up right now. And your work, you just worked with her, uh, you know, pretty recently. How did that come together? Um, through um, XL, you know, because XL, um, um, my, my, one of my, one of the XL and ours, whatever, whatever you do that, he just like, a big part of XL. Um, I've been working with XL for some years, so Jamie, he always be helping me out and shit. Cause you know, XL, that's why I like. That's why they're like my favorite, like one of my favorite labels, cause they, they artist development. Like they help me develop. You know, like they the reason. Like I'm not, like they can't. They've been to most of my shows, so you know, like they told me like, like 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 what to do and when I was doing shit like that. So um, so with that said, and then um, FK Twigs, like I just it's crazy cause we were sampling her music, right. and then and then um. Andrew hit me up like Andrew and Andrew and Jamie hit me up like you want to collab with FK Twigs? I'm like yeah. And then she Facetimed me like we was on the phone for like 40 minutes. Then she out night became like my best friend. Like my like she she taught me hella shit. She's so smart and it's so crazy because she's not American. So she like when she came to Chicago, she ain't know how American. Like she it was just crazy because we had a show together and shit. So it was, that shit was just crazy. But yeah, that came together. That's that's cool. That's my homie. Like that's my. So go go get her um, album that came out. Yeah, absolutely, man. She's doing really big stuff. Now you know you're you just played at Riot Fest. You're one of you know, a couple of hip hop acts on the bill, and they've got hip hop. You know, that's like obviously. I'm not hip hop. Well, rap, 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 rap. I'm not a rapper. What would you describe it as? I'm some new. That's what you call it. Some new. Okay. That's what you call it. Some new. From so now. you're your, your own kind of artist. Lucky I'm lucky, lucky X. X. Lucky X. How do you feel no like more. you're? Hey, I'm sorry, 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 sorry. No more E C K. No, no more E C K. Money sign. It's sure. just X. Sure. Just X. Yeah. Lucky X. How do you feel like your sound mixed with the day? Because obviously there's a lot of different types of music on the bill. You know, a lot of it's the punk rock scene, and you're doing something really different. How do you feel like it blended with that? I feel like that was perfect because, you know, I'm something new. Like, I'm not just like, when you hear my beats and you hear me rap and you hear the flows, you don't hear, you don't hear, you don't, you don't, like, it don't, it don't just sound like, yeah, you don't hear nobody else me. You hear the words, you hear the lyrics, you know, you feel me? And I put, like, a lot of thought into my lyrics, you feel me? So people was just, like, that's why people was just coming, just walking, just, what you call it? That shit was just fun. It was a really good crowd. Yeah, it was a really good crowd. That shit was fun. And they was just vibing with me, listening. It's a lot of old, it's a lot of older people out there, too, that was just fucking with me. I, I fuck with that. I saw a lot of Chicago talent in the crowd, too. I saw Nether Friends. I saw Hood Internet. Uh, there were other ones. But, you know, there was a lot of Chicago representing, you know, I think, wanting to see what you're all about. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But that's because, um... I'm not gonna lie, like I first few perform, I only perf- I went on how many performances I did like I performed like 15 times. Right? 15 times. Yeah, He's like Daddy Brown tour yeah, shit. yeah, I, I did. Yeah, he he DJ for me on the Daddy Brown tour, but like, I did a um, I did a um, like my shows, like my show, I, I was just yeah, trying to Reggie. find myself. Yeah, I was trying to find myself. I headlined the show in Reggie's. That shit was busting. That shit was amazing. That shit was fun. That shit, but I, I tweaked because I was forgetting lyrics and shit. But and I had to learn how to find myself. But this, 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 this what I was telling my fuck on Twitter. Like this was the show. Like I found myself. I know how to perform. I got it now. That's a lot I, of per, a lot of confidence on stage. That's what I saw. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That, yeah that's, that's, that's 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 what I was trying to bring more. Now you know this was uh, the hey, Red Lucky Bull. X, Lucky X is not stuttered. He is off the Molly. This is the Red Bull Sound Select uh, stage. So, what have you been doing with Red Bull Sound Select? Red Bull, they've been supporting me since I was 15 years old. I swear to God, I love Red Bull. Shout out Brock from Red Bull, Andrew because he um he was like yeah, curator. Shout out Andrew, shout out Andrew, Andrew Barber. Andrew, Andrew Barber does so much work. He does such good work. My brother, like that is our like, like even though he don't manage me no more, like that's still my big brother. Like for real, like to, like, to the heart. Before I stopped Bruce for lucky, even though about my beats, he used to mess with my beats. He ain't mess with the rapper so hard, but he mess with my beats. He's always tell me. We knew each other. We all knew each other for a minute, like long time. Like, well, they knew each other for, for like a, a little minute, but. But like we knew, I knew I I knew him basically since I was like 14 years old. All all of them basically. Chicago is such. I mean, like in all the different scenes, it's such a small community. Everybody knows each other. Everybody sees the work that everybody's doing, right? Mm, I don't really pay attention to people, (laughs) except for the motherfuckers that I'm on their ass. Yeah, basically. Except for the motherfuckers. We coming for everybody. Everybody. We coming for everybody. But y'all still my friends. But. If, we yeah, we fuck with y'all, but I'm, if I'm on your ass, I'm on your ass. That's what I'm, I'm paying attention to. But I ain't paying attention to, like, nobody, like, because I ain't going to lie, like, I'm not the same, not because people going to finish be like, because now I just did that, people finna start be like, look, yeah, it's cocky. But look, it's a lot of motherfuckers in Chicago, as soon as they hear alternative trap, start making alternative trap type music. Hey. So now, motherfuckers know I'm, I'm always going to change. I'm going to keep changing. That's how it's going. A whole, a, a whole new genre. A whole new genre, and I'm keeping, I'm going to keep it, keep doing it. Nice, man. Well, what's next for Lucky X? What else is coming up on deck for you through the end of the year, beginning of next year? What else is coming up? Um, I'm going to be in Europe in November. Um, um, Europe in November with these two. 
Well, now he gonna be in school. So with this one, Thanksgiving. Thanksgiving. Oh, oh, with these, I'm being Europe with these two. Um, shit, a lot of shows. Just you know, I just signed to a book agency. Um, a EP, a EP, hella raw shit. So I'm really this least the song I'm finishing. I'm gonna finish off the body hat on videos, and then the um, EP in December. Or January, December or January. Just in the wind, just when it's really cold, so people can be out inside. Yeah, I'm looking forward to it, man. Uh, Lucky X, doing big stuff. Just played at Riot Fest. The new mixtape is called Body High. Thank you so much, man. All right, thank you so much, bro. Hey, hey one more thing, bro. Yeah. Shout, out, shout out DJ Southbucks, man. We just rocked this show, man. Don't be on the lookout. Yeah, DJ Southbucks. 197, say money, you hit me. Hey, what's up? Nash Fett, Nash Fett. Nash Fett, Nash Fett. All right, thanks, bro.